Well, it is a Friday night. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm just riding around. I'm probably gonna go to the garage to hang out with uh, some homies. And uh, just honestly, just chill out. My car was about to die, which is kind of upsetting. But it is what it is. I, I don't know. Riding without music is just so hard. Like, it's an actual task. I thought he was braking in the middle, in like the left lane. I was like, yo, what are you doing, buddy? Like, what is going on? You know, is there like an explanation for this? Or, you know, should I just like assume you're like brake checking me? And just like start praying or something. Man, it's a real cool night tonight. I can feel it starting to get colder, but it's not too bad right now. I got the uh, the RX sevens together. <laughs> oh, that's crazy! Not the F one fifty. Not the F one fifty pulling up. He's going for it. Is he gonna make the devious cut? Probably not. That's so crazy. I was just talking to Kishan at the racetrack, like down the street. And then I ride home, I see this. Nah, this is so tough. Nah, that's awesome. <laughs> Nah, that's crazy. Bro, Steven. Jared, nice to meet you, man. <laughs> Steven, I was literally, dude, I literally left the racetrack. I saw him, like, behind me. I was like, no way Kishan's, like, that far behind me. Then, like, I see him pull up. I was like, damn, that's a whole different RX7. Yeah, that's what. I was like, I was, <laughs> I was like, yo, there's another one up here. Yeah, no, I think I think I got it too. I was, yeah. I think I was recording. Is the light flashing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, 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 I got it then. No, that thing's tough. A little carbon fiber wing too. A little plate. Thing's sick. Sheesh. A little oh, underglow. We got peanut butter insides. And a sunroof. And a rear white. No, oh, this is USDM spec, and it got Valenti mirrors. I think that's what they're called. Whole bunch, whole bunch of carbon fiber goodies everywhere. Nah, this thing is awesome. We got two, we got two FDs at the gas station. Nah, that thing is sick. I was riding home, I was just talking to him at the gas station. I was riding home, I see the FD tail lights behind me, I was like, yo. He left before me, no shot. And it's another FD. I'm like, yo. <laughs> and then uh, suddenly I saw the footage of me like <laughs> moving him along. He's like, yo, there's another one of y'all up there. Come on. So anyway, he pulled up. That's his dad's truck. 
I thought that was an undercover cop. I was like, dude, no shot undercovers are driving that. But that thing is also insane. Let's have a little look at it. I'm not a huge truck guy. This thing's pretty freaking clean, though. Like, it's a nice big white truck. I feel like my testosterone has, like, tripled just looking at this thing. Like, I feel like a real man now. Oh, yeah, so let me just uh, build this house here and hunt down this deer. Yeah, this is an AR-15. Yeah, this thing shoot 556. No, this thing's sick. Gosh, what a big truck. I don't know why you need something this big, but welcome to America. Yeah, the CVR is just chilling there. And then we got two FDs. That's crazy. You know, nice like this. JDM spec, USDM spec. I don't know. Which one do you guys like more? I honestly had no idea this was going to happen, but I'm glad I left a little bit later. <laughs> No, that thing's sick. Dang, that's awesome, man. What nice cars these are. Too bad I can never work on a rotary because it'll blow up on me. Well, it will blow up anyways, but... But, like, what do you guys like more? Big wing? Little carbon wing? I don't know, man. Like, this looks very... OEM plus but this is very like oh I race my car around the toge you guys can't catch me I don't know I think this is that's giving this is kind of giving more like that little vibe but overall they're both really sick the wheels though I, in my opinion this keeps it between us I like Kashan's wheels a little bit more yeah but this guy's car is super clean though like respectfully very clean looking car and this mid, like blue looking color kind of like changes between like a blue and a green like as you like look at it like as the light reflects on it super sick well you said you lived in japan you said you lived in japan that's sick dude damn why don't you come back here out of curiosity <laughs> mm. I see. My, uh, Heavy equipment moving for the military. That sounds insane. Operate trains? What the hell? I can't operate a train. That's an undercover cop. <laughs> yeah, no, that is one of the more obvious ones that I've seen. This thing has a lot of things done to it, and I can't really tell. But this thing looks actually so sick. We have been sitting, chatting for a little minute about the cars. You know, these things are so amazing, man. Like, the way you can just meet people just on the street like that and just instantly become homies over a machine is interesting. But it's definitely awesome. But, yeah, I think I'm going to peace out. Say bye to everybody and uh, head home. Alright, I'm gonna go, but uh, good night. Alright, good night. Alright, night, bro. Be safe. Alright, be safe, guys. Yeah. And a Camaro has the same exact color, too, which is super funny. Because he pulled up right behind us. So that's like super cool. But yeah. I'm gonna head home. Tonight was a quiet night, but then this happened. It made it a very not, made it a very not very quiet night. But yeah, I'm really thirsty, so I'm going to go home because I need a drink ski. We do have to be kind of wary of that, uh, that undercover though. Yeah, none of us are making that, bro. That's okay though. It's gonna have a nice chill ride home. I am definitely sure that that's that undercover cop from earlier. Like, that is that same Ford Explorer that we saw at the gas station.
Yeah, I'm definitely just gonna have a chill ride the rest of the ride home because I'm not trying to mess with all that. Yo, I don't know how well you guys can hear right now. I also look like an egg. I realized that. I'm having such a bad hair day. I'm gonna get out of that soon. I desperately need that. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You know, a quick little one I just put together. It was super chill. I'm trying to make it not too long and also not too short. Uh, yeah, um, stay tuned. Got a pretty big video about just fixing the entire bike. That's gonna be so long to edit. But I'm gonna start that probably tomorrow. But I have a lot of videos to edit, maybe like three or four. So I really gotta lock in and kind of just figure all that out. But nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you guys be kind to yourselves, be kind to each other, be kind to the world, and just be good people. Peace, guys.